And he knew that it took a long time for people to understand what he was trying to tell. So hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. And today I'm actually going to be reacting to Amid that the bread pastor admits Jesus never said I am son of God. I think there is many videos on the internet that actually say this and I'm sure you guys have seen a couple because I think we've actually um, reacted to quite a few. So this channel is actually about reaction videos. If you guys want us to react to music, um, trailers, movies, songs, whatever the case is, vlogs, TikToks, you name it and we'll actually do it for you guys. Other than that, other than this YouTube channel, we have another YouTube channel where we post our day-to-day -day lives or other vlogs. It's called Funny and Jesse 2.0. You can actually check out, um, you can actually check it out because we posted, I think, two to three videos. Yeah, and hope you just have fun. You can also support us on Patreon. Uh, we launched our page, is it page or whatever it's called, a few um, few weeks ago. And you can just support us. You can choose whatever package suits you guys. I, th I don't think we even have a lot of packages, but there's one or two which you can choose from. And I mean, we already have videos to go with whatever we want to be doing there. And so I would really, really appreciate your support. Also, I'd like to thank everyone that's been supporting us from the beginning till now. You guys are the best and just keep on being good. You're, you're doing a lot for us. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. Yes, I am addressing you, Revere Derek Bok. Kindly tell me if Lord Jesus, during his lifetime, did ever say that he is the Son of God himself? Did he ever say? Quote authority from the Bible. Yes. Yes, I referred to, um, to this question. At Caesarea Philippi, where Jesus asks his disciples, Who do you think I am? And then Peter proclaims, You are the living Christ, the Word of God. So there he proclaims himself God. And no, I don't catch the point, sir. You say that Peter says that you are God. I say you did not you did not listen to my question. My question is, did Lord Jesus himself say with his own mouth that he is the Son of God? That is the question. Quote from Bible, please. Yes, uh, maybe I should call uh, my my colleague, Pastor Anne Kabelgaard. Because I'm not so clever. On a couple go, he, he may come forward. <laughs> I want you to quote from the Bible. Yes, uh, my colleague is uh, very mighty strong in the scriptures. Which I'm not. Uh, <laughs> No, Jesus, we do not have these words. That is clear. That is clear. But Jesus was a very good pedagogic. And he knew that it took a long time for people to understand what he was trying to tell. So he had to try to use three years to tell his closest friends and even they had difficulty in understanding. He had to reveal it step by step. Yeah. 
ما المسيح ابن مريم إلا رسول قد خلت من قبله الرسل وأمه صديقة كانا يأكلان الطعام انظر كيف نبين لهم الآيات ثم انظر أنا يؤفكون Come Allah, here we come to serve you, here we come, no partner do you have, all praise to you, the universe is yours, here we come Allah, here we come. That was quite an interesting um, video. But then, this is what I always say. Are we not all considering ourselves as sons and daughters of God? So what's the, what's actually, where's, where does the problem come in when Jesus claims to be the son of God? You are seated down and saying you are the daughter or son of God. So what's the problem? Are you... Does a problem come in when you're thinking of it in bio biological terms or what? Even that wouldn't make sense to me. I'm just saying, at the end of the day, we all know Jesus was a messenger. So why not focus on the good part of the message that he said? Does it matter today if I say I'm the daughter of God? If a messenger is a messenger... Maybe focus on what the message, focus on the message the messenger has brought. Muslims believe, um, believe Jesus was a messenger. Christians also think, well, certain Christians also accept Jesus was a messenger. Other religions, I'm guessing as well, also accept he's a messenger. So why not focus on that at the end of the day? I mean, I guess the question, the question he asked was to get clarification of um, what actually Christians mean by saying Jesus said, I am the son of God, or why he said that, or actually where he actually says, I am the son of God. So if he didn't say that, why is this constantly, constantly brought up as, no, why why do people say he's the son of God or why does he call himself so if it's not in the Bible it's not in the Quran it's not anywhere else what's a big deal but otherwise I'm um, actually for videos like this that make you think about certain things it doesn't bother me if Jesus said he was the son of God I consider myself a daughter of God so it really doesn't affect me I know he was a messenger from everything that I've been learning all this time I'm get things become clear you need to ask you need to be open to finding out things but then if every time you're watching something like this or hearing from your friends speak about religion you just want to come in with the same point in order to attack them or something then it loses the point of actually talking about it otherwise great question I love Amit Ditat and I wish they could have given him a better answer. Although I feel like the first the first person that wanted to respond to him maybe was limited in English or something. I'm not even sure. But that's what I picked up from this video. I mean, we all have different opinions. Let me know what you guys' opinions are and let me know in the comment section below. So yeah, great video. I wish they did better at answering him. Let me know how you feel about this particular video and the reaction. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next reaction video.